Now there are so many ways to back up your contacts to your PC. But um, in this video, I'll be showing you guys two simple ways to do it. But that's it, let's begin. So for the first method, you just have to go to contacts.google.com. Alright, so after you get to the website, make sure you select your account. If your account is not selected, you can just click here to change the account to the one you are familiar with. And then you'll see all the contacts you have displayed on the screen. For me, I have 150 contacts, but uh, you may have more or less. And then what you have to do is just come down here to where it says export, click it, and then make sure you select contacts, not frequently contacted or any other one. Select contacts. You can either select Google CSV or Outlook CSV, but I'm just going to stick to this one. If you want to use Outlook, you can click it, but I'm just going to use Google. And then I'm going to click export. Because I'm using Firefox, this is what's going to be displayed. If you use Chrome, it's going to be different, but um, all you have to do is just save the file. So I'm going to click OK to save the file. And um, the icon up here just shows that it has um, downloaded the file. You can see it by clicking it. So this file can be opened with um, Microsoft Excel. So if you have the Microsoft Office suit, you can just double click this and uh, you're going to see all the contacts that you have on your um, Google account. So this is the first way to do it using your PC. The second way to do it involves using your phone and um, I'm going to display my phone right now. So while on your phone, you need to open the contacts app. But before I do that, let me bring up my cursor. All right, so now I have my cursor here and um, all Android phones come with this contacts app. So you just need to look for yours and then open it. So after you open it, um, mine has this icon up here, which is the settings icon or menu icon. And I'm going to tap it to open it as well. And over here it says import slash export contacts. You need to click it and then select export contacts. Now you select export to VCF file. So the phone is going to ask you where you want to save the backup for your contacts. And um, I usually like saving it in the root of my internal storage. So it means immediately I open my internal storage, I'm going to see the file. So that's why I'm going to save it. I'm just going to scroll through because I believe I made a backup before. But um, it was called backup. So this I'm just going to leave it at uh, contacts. So I'm just going to tap save now. And yeah, it will be saved. So to know that it's been saved, just check here and it says finished exporting contacts. Now you can send this file to your computer to keep as a backup. So whenever you need it again, you can just send it to your phone. Now. This file cannot be read by the computer unless you have a software that can do that. But um, that is why I showed you guys the first method. That file that you're going to save, the Google CSV, CSV or CFS, I don't remember. But that file is going to be a Microsoft Excel file which you can easily read and see all the numbers that you have on your phone. Alright, so that's basically all for this video and um, if you have any questions just let me know and yeah. I hope my audio is a bit better. If it is, just give me a thumbs up. And uh, yeah, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.